Today I'll show you how to use HeyGen AI avatar free using a digital clone of yourself, like I'm using now. In this HeyGen AI tutorial, you'll learn how to use HeyGen step by step to create AI talking avatar videos for free. It's one of the best text to video AI tools out there, perfect for YouTube automation, growing your brand, or even boosting sales with endless content made in minutes. You could even combine it with Google's newly released AI video generator, Google VO, to create scroll stopping AI videos. Thanks AI Avatar Tim. And to get started with using HeyGen AI Avatar Free, where you get a custom AI video avatar, that's a digital clone, and you can produce three videos per month, every month, great for small creators, then click the link in the description and pin comment below. You'll also get a discount if you upgrade to the creator plan, more on that a little bit later. But once you click that link, you can then sign up for free. So I've already got an account, but let's create a new account from scratch. Okay, so I've signed in using a different Gmail account that I've got, and then we'll click choose free, and then go through the survey real quick. Just click whichever ones, it doesn't really matter too much. And here we are on the dashboard. So to go ahead and create your own digital clone, click create your avatar. It does go through a bit of an introduction video here describing what the process is, how to go about filming your digital twin. There's a few guidelines there, but to be honest, all you really need to get started is to use your smartphone, put it up at about eye level, pointing at you with some maybe natural light coming from the window and have a nice clean background behind you. Then just frame yourself kind of with your elbows up and then you need to speak to the camera for about 30 to 60 seconds without stopping and keep looking down the camera. Try to use natural expressions, small head movements, maybe just generic small hand movements as well. Try not to confuse it with large hand movements like this or massive head turns and nods like this as well. Just in general, try not to be too erratic but also remember to smile and also really important is to pause in between sentences like this and then start your next sentence. And then when you finish that sentence, close your lips again like this. That's the main guidelines. So now we'll move on to the next step. But if in doubt or just before recording, definitely check out this guideline video. It is very helpful. Moving on, we'll get started. Again, we've got some written guidelines summarizing all the things that you need to do when you're recording your video. But as I said before, for your first effort trying this out, you don't need to go too crazy. Just set things up, hit record, try a few takes, pick your best 30 to 60 second block of talking to the camera and then move on. Next is the upload stage. So I've got a pre-prepared video that I'm gonna upload right now. There we go, I prepared a two minute video. I'll select this box and move on to the next step. You then need to give permission to HeyGen to allow them to make a digital clone of yourself. Do this with a written consent and then also a video recording consent recorded on your webcam. So I'll go ahead and do those steps. I might lose the video recording from the camera if we do that. Okay, and here's my webcam from my laptop and I'll record this offline for security purposes. So I'll see you in a second. Okay, I recorded that from my webcam over here and you can see with intended 20 seconds it has been validated so we'll go ahead and click next now and the footage will be uploaded reviewed processed and will be ready to go for the next step so I'll just pause the video here until that's finished okay the evaluations finished it says I failed this one here but I looked at the camera 99.9% .9 of the time, so I'm happy to submit this because it does say it may not be perfect. You're still able to submit if you're happy with the quality of the footage, which I am. So I'll hit submit and now it goes ahead and uploads. And it was already uploaded, so that took no time at all. The avatar is now being created and it's gonna take a few minutes for it to be processed. Great, that's processed. I'll just put the name of my avatar in here, tick that box, press continue. And now we are ready to produce our first AI avatar talking video. Let's do that by clicking here, create a new video. I'm gonna go landscape, skip this step. I'm gonna choose my avatar here and select myself. Click that one and that will bring me in, perfect. Now it's already cloned my voice, so I'm gonna go ahead and paste in my script, which is the introduction to today's video. I've made a few adjustments to the spelling to make sure it pronounces Jen as J and then some full stops wherever AI appears to get it to say AI and not something like AI. If I wanted to, I could put in some graphics or even captions, but for now I'm gonna keep it nice and simple and go ahead and generate. I'll give it a name, I'll keep all these settings the same. I can't go any higher than 720p for the free account and then hit submit and then wait for the magic to happen. Great, that only took three to four minutes to process 30 seconds. Now go back to the start of the video to see that result again. But first, imagine the possibilities of you creating your own digital twin and feeding HeyGen scripts of content that you can then post on your YouTube channel, YouTube Shorts, TikTok, Instagram, all kinds of platforms. Use this workflow in your business to help build your brand's awareness, generate sales, and educate your customers. HeyGen's AI avatar and combining it with AI video generators such as Google VO is really gonna supercharge your content. Speaking of Google VO, check out this video next if you haven't already seen the power of Google VO and what's possible with it. Also subscribe to the channel so you can get more AI workflow updates just like this. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.